everyone, it is your local librarian, Miss Fenling, and today I'm going to be doing a quick talk book talk over Nil by Lynn Matson. So, as always, here is the cover. Um, you can tell, obviously, there's an island involved, there's a little mystery involved, and maybe even some death. Charlie's from Roswell, Georgia. Don't confuse this with Roswell, New Mexico. There's no UFOs. Well, she's on her way going to Target, and all of a sudden, she gets overtaken by what looks kind of like a shimmering heat wave. She blacks out, and then all of a sudden, she ends up without any clothes, I might add, on Nil, this island. When she pops up on Nil, she has no idea what's going on. She doesn't have any clothes, and she has to figure out how to survive. Well, she ends up finding this pair of shorts and a bandana and a shirt and some sandals. And so she ends up being able to clothe herself. And after 12 days, she ends up finding two other people, Thad and Jason. Well, she ends up getting a little bit of a crush on Thad and they end up taking her back to the only camp out or city in Nil. What ends up happening is she finds out one of Nil's most dangerous secrets. No one on Nil, on the island of Nil, lives or stays on the island longer than 365 days. I know, that's pretty crazy. There's only one way that the other teenagers on the island think that you can get off the island, but it's not proven that they actually get to go home from where they came from. There's so many places that these other teenagers have come from on the island. Yeah, did I say teenagers? Only teenagers get chosen to come to Nil from 13 to 19 years old. The youngest one, Jason, he's 13, Charlie's 17, and Thad is 17. So why teenagers? Is there a way to get off the island? And how are they for sure that if they go through a gate, that they're even gonna make it back? Do people die? What happens? Read the book to find out. Nil by Lynn Matson. And you can pick it up at the library, come to check it out. Here it is again. And as always, don't forget to check out the library website. Thanks for watching.